today's video is a what I eat in a day. It is a fast food edition. Um, it's geared toward, you know, the busy mom or the busy person that has to eat out but still want to stay within their calories. Now, I did do um, a 1,500 calorie day because I figured that is the average when people are trying to lose weight. Um, this is a collaboration video with Shalena Unique here on YouTube. I will link her information in the description box below. She also did a fast food edition video, but it is staying um, on budget. So she does have a dollar amount that she is trying to stay within. Definitely check her out. Again, her information will be in the link or in the description box below. Um, the video today is basically me going to different fast food places that I think um, majority of people probably go to and um, me trying to find items that I can get and still stay within my 1500 calorie um, deficit, I guess you can say, uh, or not deficit, wrong word, <laughs> 1500 calorie day, <laughs> let's just say. Um, if that is something you are interested in, definitely continue watching. All right, guys, so I'm about to get breakfast. Um, I think I'm going to go to Starbucks. And I'm going to do that place. I had a, another place in mind, but I'm going to do Starbucks because that's the typical place people go. Um, a lot of the times, especially when they're on the go, a lot of people like coffee in the morning. Um, so that's just the typical place that I think majority of people go. Um... So, yes, yeah, so I'll stop there. Plus, I think I want the caramel frappuccino. I think. Um, so, yeah, breakfast for me is more like, yes, get healthy options. However, have a little treat in breakfast as well. Um, because you can burn it off throughout the day. So that's just my little tip and trick there. So my treat would be um, whatever frappuccino I get. And I'm going to get, I'm not going to get a grande. I'm not going to get a venti. I'm going to get a tall. So um, just a small little treat, <laughs> not a big treat. Um, and yeah, that's, that's what I'll do. And I'll show you guys when I get it. All right, guys. So these are the egg bites. Um, and this is pretty much what they look like, how they come. They're very, very delicious. Um, they also have uh, the other ones that aren't egg whites. It's just a regular egg. And of course, those has more calories. But if you have um, enough allotted for the day, then you can definitely get those. I just prefer the egg whites. To me, they taste better. And then um, also we got, hey, I asked for a tall and they gave me grande. I didn't even realize that. Ugh. I promise y'all I asked for a tall. But anyway, <laughs> here is um, the pumpkin frappuccino. And um, have almond milk, no whipped cream. So, of course, that takes off some calories as well. But I just, um, you guys see how many calories, when you guys see how many calories everything is, I just did it for, um, with everything, whipped cream and everything, regular milk because that's typically what people get so yeah and that's breakfast as you guys can see the egg cups is 170 calories and the frappuccino is 400 and i also wanted to leave you guys with some other breakfast ideas because i do know everybody does not eat like me we do have some oatmeal from starbucks which is only 220 calories and if you wanted maybe Smoothie King, you can get the dark chocolate banana vegan smoothie for 490 calories. Hey guys, so it is about 11.30 and I am about to get my lunch. So the goal is to stay within my calorie range, um, 1500 calories today. So, I'm going to, hmm, I think I'm going to go to Chick-fil-A. Um, 
because I know they have grilled nuggets. So that's healthy. Um, that should be very low calories. And then they have a salad. I wonder if they still have it. It's a superfood salad. So it has um, the greens, of course. Um, uh, is it almonds or pecans? It's some type of nut. And then it has the uh, cranberries and it has its own little dressing. It's a really good salad and it, it, it does keep you um, full for a little bit. But I'm going to do it as a side salad. So I'm going to get the smaller portion because it does come in two different sizes. So I'm going to do the smaller portion because I'm getting nuggets, the grilled nuggets. So instead of getting fries, I'm going to get the side salad. So that's my thought process. All right, I guess I'll show you guys what I got while I'm at the stoplight. Or, yeah. So I got the eight count of the grilled nuggets here. Um, I didn't get any sauce because I don't really need it. To me, their grilled nuggets are pretty good alone. Um, but if you do get sauce, just do keep in mind that that does add um, a few more calories. So you definitely want to, you know, get some information and figure out how many calories it will add on. Then I got the super fruit salad here. So it is a small little side salad. So I opted for this instead of the um, fries. That there. Now it does come with, and you put it on yourself, um, I guess to make the salad, you know, a little heartier. Um, and you know what, they didn't give it, oh yes I did. Uh, where is it at? So it does come with your nuts here. And that will make the salad a little heartier. Okay, and that is what I'm gonna have for my lunch. Um, and mind you, if you, that's just, that will keep me full. Um, if you know that your appetite's a little bit bigger, you can definitely get the bigger salad. There is um, a bigger portion of that um, superfood salad. Um, you can definitely get that. Um, I will try and put the calories for that somewhere. And then um, you can also get the 12 count of the nuggets. So I will put the calories for that as well somewhere in the video. All right, so that is my lunch. And that ended up being 330 calories. Also, some other sides would be the fruit that they have that can go with the chicken as well. Or you can just get a grilled chicken wrap that is only 350 calories or a grilled chicken sandwich, which is 310 calories. All right, guys, I am currently driving and I'm going to go pick up some dinner. So again, I'm trying to stick to places that most people go. So I guess I'll go to Wendy's. Wendy's is typically everywhere. So um, we'll go to Wendy's and find some items that we can get. I have about 600 more calories to go um, for dinner. So that's a good amount of calories for dinner, I think. Um, and I'm actually not too hungry, to be honest. Um, so I'm probably going to get something light. But I will also give you guys some ideas of what you can personally, or what you can, you can get. That's not a salad. Because I'm probably going to get a salad. All right, let's see what we get. All right, guys. So here is my salad from Wendy's. And this is just the ha half size. I didn't really want a full-size salad because I'm not that hungry um, at all. This is the uh, apple pecan uh, salad. And I only got a half a salad. So I believe this salad with all of this stuff, this is the dressing. And then um, the uh, pecans. I believe with everything, this salad is three. 140 calories 
And if you got the full size, it would have been 560, I think. I'm pretty sure I'm butchering that. If I am, or either way, I'll still leave the calories when I show you guys how I, you know, make it look all pretty and put it on the plate. <laughs> and, um, but yeah, that's going to be enough for me today. If I get hungry, I still will have a couple of more calories uh, to kind of play with. But I think that's going to be it for me. I'm really not that hungry. All right. So um, that's pretty much it. The only other items I've seen would be the baked potatoes. So you can get the sour cream and chives for 310 calories or the plain for 270. All right, guys. So that was my what I ate in a day within 1500 calories while you're on the go. So definitely check out some of the items um, when you're out on the go and you just need to grab some fast food. Definitely opt for some healthier options. Um, most fast food places now does have, I believe they have the calories on the menu now. If not, you can always find it online or you can definitely check out um, one of the fitness apps that allow you to put in your meals like um, uh, MyFitnessPal or um uh what's the other one i don't remember the other one. Oh, uh lose it those definitely allow you to put in your calories so you can definitely check that out also please 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 don't forget to check out shalana's page um it is shalana unique her link will be um in the description box down below and definitely check her out. Um, she's an awesome YouTuber. I love enjoying her videos or watching her videos. Um, but yeah, just check her out. And that is it, guys. I hope you guys have a great day. Um, please hit a like, comment, subscribe, all that great stuff. All right. You guys stay blessed.